it is not practical for a user to access the application from node IP address and then high range of node ports. There are scenarios where you need to expose the application with externally accessible URL with the domain name on HTTP or HTTPS with SSL configurations as well. In this scenario, you can use ingresses which can expose HTTP and HTTPS routes from outside the cluster to the services within the Kubernetes cluster. Traffic routing is controlled by the rules defined in the ingress resource. Ingress controller and ingress resources will handle these functionalities and Kubernetes will not come with the ingress controller by default. So if there is no ingress controller set up, ingress resources will not work. So there are many ingress controllers available that you can pick and choose based on the private and public cloud environment that you have. Nginx ingress controller is a widely used ingress controller which can be used in private cloud as well as with AWS Elastic Kubernetes Service, EKS, Google uh, Kubernetes Engine, GKE as well as in Azure Kubernetes Service AKS. There are other ingress controllers as well. So if you're looking for ingress controller other than Nginx ingress controller for AWS uh, Elastic Community Service EKS, you can use AWS Load Balancer Controller from AWS as well as Salando also has a Cube ingress controller which works with the application Load Balancer. And if you are looking for an ingress controller for Azure Kubernetes Service, you can use Azure Application Gateway ingress controller as well instead of the Nginx ingress controller. As you see in the diagram, when a client sends the traffic into the ingress controller managed load balancer, the request will be routed to the service based on the routing rules that you have defined in the ingress definition. So here is an example YAML definition for an ingress. In this example, kind is ingress, you can define all the rules under spec rule section Host can be defined in the host section, but the host section is optional and all paths can be defined under HTTP path section. Here there are two paths configured slash foo and slash bar. When a request comes to myapp.com slash foo, it is routed into foo service on port 4200. When a request comes to myapp.com slash bar, it is routed to bar service on port 8080. So path type is defined as prefix, which do the path machine based on the URL prefix. Additionally, path type can be defined as exact to match the URL path exactly. And also please note that these paths are case sensitive. Ingress controller supports different ingress configurations, which can be enabled by adding different annotations. These annotations will get differ based on the ingress controller that you are using. In this example, uh, this is uh, related to the Nginx ingress controller. What it does is it rewrites the URL to slash when the traffic is routed to the service. 